welcome to the book talk. I am Mr. Book. Today my book talk is about a biography of Dr. Seuss, which is part of the Who series of books for kids published by Grossa and Dunlap. I like to call those books bobbleheads because the covers have pictures of people with enormous heads and tiny bodies. This book is titled Who Was Dr. Seuss? It was written by Janet B. Pascal and illustrated by Nancy Harrison. This book is about Dr. Seuss's life from when he was born in 1904 until he died in 1991. Dr. Seuss changed reading for kids by making books with rhymes and funny drawings. Almost everyone has read at least one Dr. Seuss book. In fact, they have been translated into many languages. The book has a lot of interesting facts. For example, did you know that the word nerd comes from a word Dr. Seuss made up for one of his books? Also, did you know that Dr. Seuss's real name was Theodore Seuss Giesel? His middle name, Seuss, was originally pronounced Zeus, but he changed the way he pronounced it because of how Seuss rhymed with Mother Goose. Dr. Seuss began to use his middle name as a pen name after he got in trouble with the law in college. He was not a real doctor, but used the title doctor to make up for dropping out of Oxford after disappointing his father. Dr. Seuss had a very interesting life. Before he became famous, the magazine he was working for had money problems, so he sometimes was paid it with cases of shaving cream, and once he was paid with 1,872 nail clippers. He began his career by drawing cartoons to advertise a bug spray called Flit. During World War II, he drew cartoons criticizing people who wanted to stay out of the war. Also, he helped create a cartoon character called Private Snafu to show soldiers what not to do. Snafu stands for Situation Normal All Fouled Up. Dr. Seuss published his first book in 1937 called And to Think That I Saw Him on Mulberry Street. This is also my favorite book that he wrote. His last book, Oh, The Places You Will Go, was published in 1990 and is a popular gift for high school and college graduates. This book tells you about the life of Dr. Seuss and informs you how he grew up to become a great children's book writer. If you like Dr. Seuss books, then you should definitely read this book. Bye!